gonna highlight a couple of the biggies that I have here in my rigging collection. Starters, my soft bait rigging. That is for our unweighted soft plastics. Here I have the 10 inch Hoagie Original rigged with a weightless swim bait hook. I carry both weighted and unweighted. The weighted versions will keep you subsurface, whereas the unweighted you know, works fast. These original soft baits will create quite a commotion on the surface. You know, as I mentioned before, I carry all the treble hook sizes. Um, so you can see the larger hooks on the big plugs or medium plugs. Um, you know, the, the hooks go down in a gradient. Now, a lot of folks like to swap out treble hooks for single hooks on the plugs. And our heavy duty inline single hooks are great because the extra weight of the heavy duty hook will help keel the bait. And, uh, you know, they're designed to rig properly with just a single split ring. Again, we have all the sizes on our chart, so we're not gonna get into details now because there is some flexibility. And again, that's addressed in the chart. And then jigs, that's where it gets a little, um, little different where there's some more options. A, drake, a jig could be rigged with a treble hook. It could be rigged with a single inline hook, as well as a jig could be rigged with an assist hook. A good rule of thumb for which hook to use with which jig um, if you're vertical jigging, I almost always advocate for either a single inline hook or an assist hook. You know, a lot of these fish um, will hit the jig on the drop, or when the jig's going fast through the surface, up towards the surface, they'll hit it from the head. So in either case, a single hook is going to A, give a better hook set, but B, if a fish does swallow the lure, you're going to have an easier time disgorging the hook. Now, on the smaller jigs, it's a little bit of a gray area. Some people advocate for treble hooks. Some people advocate for single inline hooks. I tend to say if you're gonna fish a jig fast, a treble hook's a good option. The smaller the jig, the more likely I am to use a treble, you know, say for Albies. Um, if you're scup fishing, sometimes a, you know, a little small treble on a small jig. Um, but, um, you know, there is a bit of a debate. Some of these smaller jigs are the smaller um, inline hooks. Some people argue that those tend to get swallowed more than a treble, which tends to be more lip caught. Um, I don't think there's enough data out there to suggest which, which way is safer for the fish. Um, but a good rule of thumb is the smaller the jig, the more likely it'll have a treble. The larger the jig, the more likely it'll have a single hook. And, um, you know, and then use your discretion in between. So again, just to recap, single hooks, treble hooks, soft bait hooks, assist hooks, my entire product line I have right here, I can address anything and everything that I want to handle from a rigging perspective here.